Hey everybody, it's Ramona. Welcome back to my channel. Um, you haven't seen me in a while. I've been packing, moving, unpacking. Finally, I'm getting at the very end, unpacking, you know, candles and wax and things like that. And I have a bunch of candle holders slash candle accessories. And my friend Adam said, oh, when you're making a video, you should try to do your accessories video. I was like, oh, that's interesting. I've never seen anybody do that. If they do, I haven't seen it. If you're interested, great. If you're not interested, that's okay too. But this is what I have, what I'm calling my candle accessory shelf. Um, so, so, and I'm just, as I'm unpacking, I thought, well, this would be a good time to do it. Now I can put it away and find a place for everything. So the first thing I have is this candle warmer. Um, and I got this, um, I think I got it from candlewarmersetc.com. I think um, I've had it a long, long time. So I don't use it that often. If you don't know what it is, just basically a heated vessel it plugs in and it's warmth coming from around. So if you have a candle that is not burning well or um, is, you know, tunneling or whatever, um, or maybe you have a candle with just a little bit of wax and you want to finish it off. You don't want to waste any scent. You put it in here. You do not light the candle. The candle melts from the, the warmth around the vessel. So that is a candle warmer, handy to have. I only have one, but that's okay. I don't think I need more. Then I have two Homeworks candle um, holders. So these are obviously quite large compared to say a Bath and Body Works um, a candle holder uh, because Homeworks candles are quite large. If you don't know Homeworks, you should Definitely check out Homeworks Candles on QVC.com or Homeworks, I, uh, Google Homeworks Candles. I want to say it's Google, I mean, I want to say it's Homeworks.com, but I don't think it is. It's something different, but I love, love, love Homeworks Candles. I live in Canada now, can't get them up here unless I want to pay $100 in shipping on top of what I pay for the candles. So I have, I, I just, when I unpack my candles, I have six homeworks candles left i guess you would say i'm hoarding them i have two candy cane lane from probably three or four years ago this year maybe i'll burn one i guess i will i don't want to wait too long you know although three or four years is plenty long enough all right moving right along so then i have this candle holder which is just i don't know if, i don't know where this came from if this is bath and body works or not um what does that say Oh, made in China, of course. Uh, but anyway, so a candle will sit right on top of there like that. Then I have a larger um, uh, candle holder. This came from Walmart, and it's big enough for a three wick, uh, sorry, a, um, a jar candle like uh, Goose Creek. I don't think they make jar candles anymore or Yankee Candle, like those kind of jar candles. Um, or, of course, you could use a... Um, you can put a three wick candle in there too. There's no law against that. Then I think the rest of these are, oh no, this one is not. This one came from a store in the U.S. called Big Lots, which is a great store uh, for getting, you know, especially decor, candles, bedding, like just kind of a small department store. But anyway, um, so you can tell, it's kind of like, you can't really tell like that, but when I hold it against the white canter, you can see it's cut out almost like a cross stitch pattern, if you will. And this looks very, very pretty at night um, with a candle in it. And usually I reserve this, obviously, well, it's Christmas uh, snowflakes. So that is a Christmas candle holder. It's really, really nice. And sometimes what I do, I also have, oh, I should have brought them out. Ooh, maybe I'll pause it and go fix them, find them. Um, I set it on a candle pedestal and it looks really nice. <coughs> Excuse me. And I gave myself bronchitis, so I'm on a puffer and uh, antibiotics, so that's always nice. Uh, this is a Bath & Body Works candle holder. It has kind of like a marble bottom and copper um, metal business. Um, this is a silver colored candle holder, Bath & Body Works. This one is a fall candle holder and it has maple leaves on it. And I bought this when I still lived in Texas and I sent it, no, I ordered in Canada 
and I had it sent to my sister's. No, 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 no. I ordered from the U.S., but uh, I had it shipped to. Well, how can that be if I lived in Can? If I lived in the U.S. at the time. Uh, 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 uh. I'm not sure. Anyway, I bought it in Canada or in the U.S. I'm pretty sure I bought it in the U.S. before I, m I moved, so they must have had them in the U.S. Uh, Bath and Body Works, because not all things are the same, if you don't know. Mostly it is, but occasionally there's an odd thing that is not the same. But anyway, so this is, <coughs> pardon me, a little maple leaf um, <coughs> candle holder. <coughs> I'm so sorry. That was the bronchitis talking. All right, uh, also from Bath & Body Works, we have this one here. It has kind of gold tone bars and kind of like faux leather. It's kind of like in a woven pattern. So that's a kind of nice one too. I like that one. Um, also from Bath & Body Works, they have, the, I think it was called the Black Gate or the Gate. I don't know. It's kind of like wrought iron, I think was the intent there, but it's also on a little pedestal. So that one's really pretty. Um, and then we have two Halloween candle holders. This one I just got this year. It's on a pedestal. It's a, kind of like a really shiny mercury kind of thing. It has some gems there and a big old ruby-ish thing. And this one I got last year. It has the gold uh, spiders on it. So that's kind of cool. It's kind of like glitter. You can, I think you can see the glitter on the cobwebs. Yeah, there you go. Then I have three of these. Um, one is in use. The other one is black, kind of like a black brushed metal. Um, and they are very simply, let me, let me do this. So you can see it better actually. Um, it's just four pegs and the candle sits right down in there. So it's, I use these ones, like if there's a, um, a label that's really cute and I don't want to hide it in a warmer, I mean in a candle holder, I'll use these. This one was, it's hard to tell the difference. I think one is faded, but this one was rose gold. This one is gold gold. Oh yeah, I can tell the difference there for sure. Well, yeah. Rose gold, gold gold, and the other one, as I said, is black. And then I have a, um, what do you call these? Uh, like a topper, a candle topper. So for me, Yankee Candles, uh, the jar candles, could ne I could never get a good burn out of them. So you put these on, it kind of contains the heat a little more to get a better burn. And then finally, I have from Sensi, um, Sensi has I think three different versions of this. This is, um, I'm not sure what the name of it is, but obviously you'll see it. Um, but anyway, it's a cord warmer. So for your warmers, you can wrap your cord around there and then it comes out this side. So if you have a whole bunch of tangled cords in the back, it, it makes it a little better. <coughs> Excuse me. And as I said, there's, I think, two or three other um, cord, cord organizers um, as well. I'm going to be in trouble because that's not going to be good. But anyway, so that's my little candle accessory collection, if anybody was curious or not. Here you go, Adam. And um, so I'm almost, as I said, I'm almost done unpacking. Um, the office was a huge deal. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm packing all my wax and wax and wax. It's like, it's kind of overwhelming. So I really need to have a vendor show. I'm looking for a vendor show to go to. I've never done one before, but I'm kind of excited to try. And um, <coughs> I'll give you a, a sneak peek of what's coming. I got my holiday bricks today, and I will be doing a first sniffs of those very soon. I am not presentable today as I am in unpacking mode. But anyway, enough chit chat. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> so sorry about that. Um, and okay, I'm going to sign off because I'm going to start coughing. So if you have any questions, let me know down below. My website is always listed below as well. I hope everybody's having a great day. If you're in Canada, happy Thanksgiving weekend, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.